Okay, folks, once again, Flying Doctor here, and uh, this time just a very quick uh, video on how to set the heading on the autopilot. I've shown this as part of other videos uh, before, but this is just to allow somebody who wants to dive straight in to find exactly how to set that setting. Once again, the one thing I haven't been reminding people of is, is to get the, to the autopilot on the tablet. Um, you need to... Let's just get this to the home screen first. So you need to open up the tablet, press the lift and pull, press the settings button, and you can click here on the time button. Uh, it's not entirely obvious. And then you can find three modes. Or you can change, you can arrange the doors if you want to. I don't know. <coughs> I'm not really into it. You know, open the doors and prepare for your flight. You've got an autopilot setting, got lights as well, but we're looking at autopilot. So that's how you, you navigate to the autopilot, um, uh, using, or the way I do on the tablet. So in terms of setting the heading button, at the moment I'm just going to take us uh, off active pause. There we go. Uh, we are in hover mode at the moment, and uh, that's very helpful. I'd always kind of talk about hover mode at the same time. Uh, effectively, if I take the Alt off and I take the hover mode off, you can see strange things will happen. If you press hover mode, it will uh, get you out of jail free, and uh, you will uh, uh, find a hover position. But in terms of uh, arranging uh, your heading, it's really, really simple. Okay, on the tablet that you can see here, um, you uh, aren't able if you if you click the heading button um the tablet <coughs> tablet will give you an option to change the heading but if you want to set the heading before which i'd recommend you do if you go down here to the autopilot controls there i've just adjusted it you can see and um if you change this style you'll see the green it's actually naturally following the heading i'll take nav off um, or, or hover. Hover is following the heading. It's okay. It doesn't matter. So if you if you rotate the heading bu button, you'll see that there's a little green marker here, and that is moving around the compass, and with it, the helicopter is following. We are in hover mode, so that's one of the reasons that it's doing that, I think. Uh, but suffice to say, if I come back out and uh, I'm going to move, um, I'm going to set an airspeed, um, and uh, I do that by going down here, IAS is up here. Uh, if, you, if you move that button, you can see that there's this little blue triangle here. And uh, if I move that, we'll, we'll, we'll increase to 80 knots. You can see it's gone to 80. It's off the scale there. But you can go faster. If I click IAS now, the aircraft will, um, uh, will travel at this speed. But if I click uh, the heading button, it will follow the heading that's laid down. You won't see a change because we're in the right direction. And then if I click speed, just for, just for illustrative purposes here, uh, the helicopter will move up to speed. So there you go. Uh, if you want to change the heading mode now on the tablet, I'm in HDG mode, you can see that I can make adjustments to both speed and heading. Uh, so uh, IAS, um, I can move that down, but let's deal with the heading thing. Watch the green bug. There you go. As I, tur as I move the green bug, the helicopter will follow. Okay, simple as that. And then when it, uh, it's when it's moving to being in in the same direction as the heading setting, uh, then it will right itself. There you go. Just moving to the right there. And yes, probably is a, a good thing that I think heading and speed helpful going hand in, in hand. So, you know, I can see that Adam Brooks is over there. So I can adjust my heading uh, just to see where that is. And to see if I can get myself in that 
kind of uh, direction. So there we go. So yeah, that's it. I've actually done uh, heading and speed at the at the same time. So yeah, enjoy. Relatively straight. That's relatively um, straightforward. I think. Take care. Stay safe, folks.